Hey guys, well, I have received lately a few emails with your questions, and just to let you know that I don't help you out for free, you have to pay back by giving a like, subscribing, sharing the video, or donating money to my PayPal account. Okay, well, with that being said, thank you for watching the video. Uh, today, I would like to comment, uh, talk about uh, the three most uh, frequently asked questions. All right, question number one um, that I had lately is uh, how old it's okay for you to be with a girl in Zona Norte? How old uh, is like is the maximum? What's the maximum age? In order for you to have party in Zona Norte, I have to let you know that there's no limit. As long you you can walk, all right. As long you um, can move with no problem, uh, you're good. Actually, uh, I have seen uh, guys in their wheelchairs having fun in Zona Norte. All right, so age is not a limit. Okay. Um, I'm not saying that if you're in your uh, 60s or something, you can uh, have something to do with a girl with uh, the age of 18 or 20, but yeah, that could happen. Uh, but if that's not something that uh, happens, uh, right there in Zona Norte, they are girls in their 40s, and trust me, they will have no problem, all right, uh, having a good time with you. So age is not the limit in Zona Norte. The other question is uh, how I can date a working girl? How can I date a stripper in Tijuana? Well, that's a question that um, I get every time, okay? And uh, as I said in one of my videos, that's not like, um, how can I say it? Something that happens, all right? That's not something usual that happens here with locals. Uh, regular guys dating uh, working girls is not something that happens typically working girls uh have established relationships with the same uh, male workers in the clubs the waiters the uh, security guards and all of that right uh, rarely they establish relationships with uh customers right there yes it does happen but that's not like the norm okay typically uh, for some reason they prefer the guys that work in the place as well and locals dating strippers, that's not something uh, very usual. Yo, Albert, is it safe to be in Zona Norte? Uh, mm, well, you know, you're dealing with drunk people all over the place. Um, it's not 100% safe, but I've been going there already for around 20 years. And I have to let you know that I never, 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 ever have feel myself under risk okay maybe i don't feel that um comfortable but uh i would never have feel any kind of fear extreme fear right uh, you have just to um focus on your thing okay just chill don't mess don't overexpose yourself and you'll be good Hey Albert, uh, the girls that speak English, um, yeah, I mean, some, but like the, I don't know, 20% of them speak English, so yes, you want to learn the basic Spanish, all right, if you live especially in the West Coast, come on, man, Spanish is the official language in the West Coast, you have to learn something, all right, as well, someone asked me, um, is it better going by myself or I should take friends? And, well, that's the question. I mean, uh, that doesn't really, really give me a lot of details, all right? I don't know if he wants to be, um, to feel safer with friends or he's asking that in terms of having fun by himself uh, without any uh, friends around. Well, uh, well, yes, obviously, and uh, for safety reasons, uh, if you're a, a small crowd, all right, uh, a few friends all together having fun. Yes, that's recommended. But uh, to have fun, I don't know why. Don't ask, please. <laughs> I don't know exactly why, but I like to go alone to Zona Norte. Uh, especially if I'm not celebrating 
something, right? Because if I'm celebrating something, I will go with friends, okay? And But if I'm not celebrating something, if I just want to have fun with the girls, I want to go just by myself. Okay, well, um, I believe I, I extended a little bit of the questions. I was thinking of only mentioning three, but I believe I did mention more than three. All right, so remember, uh, answering these questions is not for free. You have to pay back by giving a like to the video, sharing the video, subscribing, or simply sending money. All right, well, guys, thank you. All right, every uh, dollar, every 50 cents that you send, it's appreciated. Have a good one. Tijuana, it's open, it's ready, it's waiting for you all. You may come down here by yourself with friends, okay, with male friends and females, all right? You may bring your uh, female friends, they're welcome in Zona Norte. They're not welcome alone. They don't allow females to enter alone. They have to enter with uh, guys, all right? All right, so if you have a female friend that wants to come here to Zona Norte and have fun, you may bring her. All right, guys, take care. Remember, you may leave all your questions in the box below. Good night.